Hello and welcome to another video. This is a video I've been wanting to film for a very long time. I bought a few items from ThreadUp a while back, like three months ago, and they've been sitting in a box in my room. So I figured to get rid of the box, I have to do the haul. So I'm gonna do the haul. I spent a total of $86.74 on 11 items and I will try to tell you how much everything costs as I show it. I'm just gonna try them on and do a little review of so. The first item I'm going over is this skirt, and as you can see, I've already made some modifications to it. I added this patch, and I put some little spikes on it, on this pocket. But I really like the skirt. The material is kind of like denim-y. I think it is denim, but I don't know. I don't really know what denim is, but I think it is like jean material. And it's very nice. The quality is nice, and I like wearing the skirt, and you know. It looks good with the shirt because, you know, black, white. It's got, it's got some nice back pockets. It's got very tiny front pockets, but it looks a lot like the image on the website. And yeah, it met my expectations. So I'm going to give this one, uh, I'll give it a nine out of 10 just because the waist doesn't fit. It's a little too loose. But other than that, it's a good, it's nice. So this next one's pretty similar. It's just a mini skirt and it's actually by J Crew. I got it for four dollars and i really like it i like the material it's kind of like a corduroy i like the color um and i really like it even though the waist is also a little big it's still fine like that's what belts are for the pockets are pretty small the back pockets are non-existent but i still think like it's really nice skirt i love the color and it's like it's not too out there like i like this blue it's very nice i will give this one a 9 out of 10 again because of the fit the next thing I got which surprise surprise is also a skirt uh, is this exhilaration skirt you know that brand exhilaration that they probably had at Walmart when I was a kid well that one um, I honestly really love this skirt and I think I have another exhilaration thing that I ordered and I really love the skirt it fits nicely it's a nice length, it's not too short, it's not too long. I think it's a nice skirt to wear with a shirt over it, as opposed to like a crop top or tucked in, which is what I like to do with a lot of my other skirts. I really like this skirt for that reason. I like the colors on it, the blue, black, gray, and I like this little like thing. Like it's like, it's just different. I don't know what's different about it, but like it's different. It was $9, it was $8.99, so $9. And yeah, that's this, so. I would give this skirt a 10 out of 10. It really, um, it has a nice material. The material is very soft and comfortable. It fits nicely. And um, yeah. The next one is this pair of black shorts and I don't have, well, prior to this, I didn't have a pair of black shorts um, for some reason. And so I, I needed to get these. And these are cool. Um, I like this little detail, even though it doesn't really, do much oh wait does it no it doesn't do anything but it's nice to have and actually the shorts are pretty tight they're a little too small for me um i think that maybe if i can shift this button closer to here i can just button it very easily instead of having to do that and hurt my stomach so what i'm doing for now is i just have the safety pin and then i just freaking like stick it and whatever they, it, I don't really care I like the look of metallic things on my clothes so it only adds to it there are no back pockets um, just fake ones for some reason it's a thing I don't know um, and then for the front ones it has pretty decent pockets it has good pockets actually look 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 look, look at here it's all the way to the end of the shorts these are good pockets they definitely make up for the lack of back pockets so honestly I would give these shorts a nine and a half like literally all i have to do is move the button like they're so nice the material's nice and i can't wait to put patches on them and stuff and customize yeah that's about all i have to say for this one next up are these green and blue plaid pants i've been wanting a good pair of plaid pants for a while and these ones really fit my needs they're really good um quality they're corduroy and they're quite stretchy so um Maybe a little bit of room. They're pretty stretchy. And um, they are like skinny jeans, uh, which I'm not the biggest fan of skinny jeans, but they are plaid. So 
<laughs> it's cool. And they also have this nice little uh, slit at the bottom that's like, I guess, useful for something. And I really like the plaid of it, which is also another issue with like plaid stuff that I've been looking for. But I'm really happy that I found these pants and that they're my size, at least with the belt. I just think that they're so good. Like, even though they don't like fit me perfectly, I'm still gonna give them a 10 out of 10 because I love them so much. They're comfortable, they're stretchy, the material is nice, it's high quality. It has back pockets that are sizable, it has, it has front pockets that are, you know, they're front pockets. I, I love these pants. I'm going to be wearing these pants all fall. I just thought of something. The sweater kind of like actually like has the same colors as it, and as a fit. Also, that's the one I put elbow pads on the other day, so you know, go watch that video. Uh, link in the description and yeah let me know is this a fit is this a fit or not is this a fit or not I'm kind of leaning towards fit but let me know guys next up is the skirt and this skirt kind of disappointed me I was under the impression that this would be a longer skirt but no it's above the knee which is like the most awkward length like right above the knee in my opinion is like the most awkward length like just go below the knee or like go well above it not like at the knee you know but whatever uh I, I really like like the pattern of the skirt it's also an ann taylor skirt and i like ann taylor stuff but i don't like the length of the skirt like it's not what i was going for in their defense the mannequin they modeled it on did not have any legs um, it was just a torso, but I just assumed that it would at least be at the knee. It looked longer in the picture. That's all I have to say. So anyways, I'm gonna give this skirt 5 out of 10. Bad. Okay, maybe a 6. It was $4 and it just kind of looked a little long. Uh, but I don't know what I'm going to do with it now. I'll probably cut it. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Figure it out. The next one is this one skirt um it's by idenko or east Enco. i'm not sure how to pronounce it but the skirt is fine i like the length of the skirt i don't really like like the dots and stuff well i mean they look fine um the material is quite wooly and it's kind of itchy so there's that but i like the length of it it fits nicely like it fits and um it's below the knee and it's 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 a cool color whatever it's brown i was honestly prepared to like shit on the skirt in the review but um it actually looks quite good on camera and it fits me nicely i really wish the other one fit me like this um but yeah whatever this one's this one's good i'll give it mm, an eight the next one is this cute little plaid dress it also has like the cute little like belt thing um but I don't feel like looping it and all the things right now. But you could tie it in the front, you could tie it in the back. I like it without it. I think it looks quite cute. Um, I like the these little like button details and this little like ruffle. And like just the way that it fits. It's such a nice dress. Like I really love it. I don't have much to say about it. This one, I would give it a 10 out of 10. I really like that it has yellow. I think that this dress would look really good with dogs and like some fishnets and something and it would be a really good like layer in piece for when it gets colder so i i just really love this dress it's so awesome it's so versatile and um it fits me well it was 12 dollars, so it was on the more expensive side of things that i bought but definitely worth it i'm really glad that i bought it the next thing i got was this dress and i really like this dress i it's not how i expected it to be but I still really like it and it has a lot of potential. It's not very form-fitting, it's quite loose, which is what makes it great. It's also a good dress that you can wear as a shirt because the material is very thin, it can fit into pants quite well. I like the cut of it and the sleeves. I really, 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 really like the plaid. I think the plaid is awesome and I might, might make it shorter. I was thinking just cut off the last two buttons make it shorter just so i can have this material to use elsewhere but just an idea i might do it later on in the life of this dress but even though it didn't feel like i expected i'm still gonna give it a tad also i think putting a corset over it is also a really good thing to do it's really cute and I'm, i really really love this dress like look at it look at it right look at it i love this dress 10 
two fives. 10 out of 10. All right, so this one's actually the other exhilaration item that I got. It's this dress and um, it's got like this like, there's, it's got stuff over here and then it's got like more stuff over here. Honestly, definitely not what I was expecting. I don't really like it. However, it does have this little like band, right? This little like waistband. And so I was thinking to cut it off right here, have a top and then have a skirt, All right? No sewing necessary because this is a cool skirt right to have I'm, I'm not too sure what i'm going to do yet but i don't really like this dress i'm going to rate it a six out of ten i do not really like it well actually seven out of ten because it has potential unlike the ann taylor skirt i don't think it's too bad but i honestly just don't like it let me try wearing a jacket over it okay now this this would actually be the only acceptable way to wear this dress. I think that this dress could work. You know, I think that we could work through our differences and form a decent, meaningful relationship. I, I think it's, it actually looks quite nice. And also I added spikes to this jacket and a little patch, a little anarchy patch that I designed. It actually looks really good with this like, jewelry and like, it looks really good like as a fit. But anyways, this dress, yeah, seven out of 10. Um, but with this jacket, a nine. The next thing I got was these shorts and um, these shorts are not what I expected them to be. I thought that they were going to be a heavier material, but they're actually just these like super comfy shorts that I wear like in my room or when I'm at home. Or also when I go to run little errands, like go to the post office or go to Walmart. And um, I love them. They're very comfortable. They're pretty stylish. You can wear them out, you can wear them at home. Um, they're, they're loose fitting, elastic band, uh, they're gray and white, so they basically match like a lot of things, and they're just nice. No pockets on them though, so that would have been cool, but I'm not holding that against them. I've worn it so many times, I basically wear it till it gets dirty, it's clean now, but yeah, it's on, it's on, the, it's on that rotation. It's, it's a really comfy pair of shorts, so yeah, I would give this one a nine and a half, you know? It's not quite what I expected, but it's still great. Anyways, that is all that I have for you today. Let me know your favorite item in the comments below. As usual, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it and it helps. And if you did not like this video, please leave a dislike and a hate comment. It really helps with the algorithm. Please subscribe to my channel. It helps me out a lot and I really appreciate all the support so far. Absolutely consider shopping from ThreadUp. You might have to look a little bit longer and harder, but you will find more unique pieces and the quality of the items are amazing in my opinion. But anyways, don't just take my word for it. Check out their website. I'm not sponsored or anything. I mean, look at me. And just remember that you really, really want to subscribe to my channel. You really want to. You want to subscribe to my YouTube channel.